Now if we talk about the post interns without a job, say you are done with your internship and say you are done with your uh, bond posting, whatever it is. And today you are saying that today I will start studying, but I will appear for 2026 exam. There are again many challenges. Again, the big challenge of regularity. There the time was less. Here you have got say one year. How to use this one year properly? What Google sir was saying for interns is true for you also. For a few days you would study a lot and then a long lean period. Regularity is going to be a big challenge. Again, you need to have a cohort. You need to have a group with which you are studying and a structure. FOMO, Goga sir. So this is the time you think that you have one year, one and a half year. So I can do almost everything. Why to miss anything? Mm. Why this FOMO comes in your mind that uh, I have so much time. Why to miss anything? So when you come to why to miss anything, the problem is you will start going into one subject in too much depth. And you in the end, you will find that either you have covered so much that that is not revisable or you have very less time left for the other important subjects. There are many students, sir. They will start with the main videos. They will add something from quick revision, from this source, that source. Finally, as you said, no time for either revision or other subjects get missed. This is what we mean by lopsided preparation. For three subjects, you have covered five resources. And for 10 subjects, you have not done even one. And then you are looking for some short note uh, to, to cover that subject. No, don't do that. These things can be avoided only and only with the structure. From day one, we should be clear what exactly are you going to cover? When are you going to cover? When will you revise? When will you revise the second time? Because sir, this is a big problem. Yes, because you have one year, you started studying a subject, so you do suppose five, six subjects in four months. And after four months, you will see that you have forgotten the first month subjects. So this commonly happens with everyone. So that is a big problem because the time is more. The longer is the time, the initials that you will try, tend to forget. So you need a proper structure, how to repetitively revise the thing so that you do not forget. 100% sir. Of course, there are advantages. You have got more time at your disposal. And if you structure it properly, of course, the chances that you would crack the exam are better.